Well, as you can see, it's mid-morning and I'm taking a, a, what I consider to be a well-earned rest on the Smithco stand and I'm with John Moore. And, uh, well, what is it we're sitting in, John? Uh, we're sitting in a Smithco Sprayed Star 2000. It's a ride-on sprayer. Uh, it's a diesel, a diesel sprayer. It has a unique system which is um, done in conjunction with T-Jet. So T-Jet are our partners. So basically, we design the running vehicle and they do all the... Uh, the fancy stuff for us. Um, so and I hear that fancy stuff is, is is quite sophisticated and one of the better fancy stuff units on the market. Yeah, we can actually control the droplet size of the from the spray boom, which means that we can actually accurately place that droplet on the leaf or uh, in the canopy, so that the um, greenkeeper can put the uh, chemicals exactly where they need them. Because as we know, chemical prices are shooting up. As our prices all over and everything, sadly to say. Exactly. <laughs> and we've also got in the corner over there something I've always loved to have a go on is a uh, turf iron, isn't it? Yeah, it's the XL7000. It's, uh, it's a triple roller. It, it basically gives you the same uh, rolling width as a greens mower. So you don't have a different width when you're actually rolling your greens. Uh, and it cuts significantly down the time that you are rolling with a single, uh, single roller. Um, it's our best seller, you know, well, I, won't, I won't hesitate to say it's, uh, we sell an awful lot of XL7000s. Yeah, I always, I mean, they're going sideways, I, I think I'd, I'd, I'd be disorientated, but I'd fancy taking the chance just to give a go on one. It takes a bit of getting used to, but actually when you get used to it, it's the best way to do it, because you can line yourself up very well with your next pass, so as you drive across the green, when you come back, you can, you can actually look at the, the line where you came down. Are you finding more golf clubs are going down that route? I know it tend to be they'd use it for special competitions, the big competitions and maybe the bigger clubs, but are you finding more clubs are, are, are looking into that type of equipment? Yeah, with the stress that's on a lot of the greenkeeping teams these days, with not having enough staff, enough people, the chemical reduction bills, um, it's been proven that turf rolling will actually reduce uh, um, some, um, some diseases. There's uh, Nikolai, he did a very good report on that. So a lot of the, uh, the superintendents and greenkeepers are using rolling not just for speeding up the greens, but also as a disease reduction. I know Smithco are also doing, you've got bunker rakes and uh, the machine that's sitting behind us just now. Can you just talk a little bit about the, you know, make sure you see what it is? It's, <laughs> it's, at the moment but it's... That's it's, another roller. We've got two rollers on the stand, ah. actually. That's, a, that's the Ultra Light. That's our lightest version. But yes, um, Smithco, probably people know Smithco from bunkers, uh, bunker rakes. Um, it, it was what our first production lines were with Smithco. Um, there is actually a Mr. Smith, it is a family company. Uh, he's based in Wayne in Pennsylvania. Um, we have two factories, one in Humboldt, uh, which is down um, in uh, Texas, sorry, Kansas. Uh, and we have Cameron, which is our biggest factory, which is in Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. So it's about an hour and a half, two hours drive from Minneapolis Airport. Well, you're looking to make strides into the UK market, obviously, the very fact that you're here at, uh, here at Harrogate. Yeah, we, you know, we want to get close to the, to the customer. Um, so our idea now is rather than have a distributor, we're going to go straight to dealers. Um, we're working with Ernest Doe's on stand we're standing today, but we are also working with Fairways up in Scotland and Broderick's in Ireland. Well, it's been lovely to have a couple of minutes sitting down in these lovely padded seats that we've got here. So Yeah, we've got to get back up again. Yeah, I know we have. <laughs> got back to work again. But yeah. great to see you. Thanks very much for your time, John. Thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you.